hello my amazing queens and kings in the building welcome back to my youtube channel if you are new here just stumble across my channel for the first time this is jesse queen and in this channel we do videos like this we act on things that comes on our way on the social media handles and every different platforms so from the title you must have known whom we are going to be reacting in case you don't know her, she is Chantel Anyaou. She is a Potakot base in Nigeria to be precise. And she had to have a wedding. That was supposed to be the wedding of the year. First of all, me personally, I have been thinking all this way that Chantel was going to wed this December. I never knew that it was going to be early 2024. Let me know down in the comment section if you feel 2024 is too too far but as for me let me be frank and sincere i think it's a little bit far because the way chantel has been planning this wedding back to back all my thoughts were that chantel was going to wait this december or latest easter next year i never knew that this wedding she's planning all this while is just let me just say two years from now so when she came back now and said the wedding has been cancelled reasons we are going to be talking about right away i was so surprised not until when she made mention of 2024 i was like wow this means this wedding is still uh, far anyway according to her she chose to cancel the wedding due to elections and due to the fact that there's no security in nigeria that much she doesn't want people to be stranded. But me, as for me, I think says, hmm, people will still marry you, election or no election. No, hmm. Me, if it's me, election or no election, I will still marry. I will tell my hobby, see, eh? let us wait first. Then we do party next. Yes. Let me just say it now. I am. This is the reaction. If it's me, I will tell hobby, you know one thing, go and pay my bride price. Do what they call omenala in Igbo land. Do all those stuffs. And then... Party go come later. Eh? This one we don't shift wedding to third of this, third of that. Hmm. Again, is how we think come they get Kele go. But anyway, Sha, as she said, it's due to election. Me, I'm even asking, don't the people wait doing election? Eh? Is Nigeria that bad? I know that maybe she has so many people out there and maybe abroad I would like to come. But Chantel, my sister, if you stumble across this video, talk to your hobby. If you never do anything for your head, eh? If he hasn't yet paid the bride price, dowry, all those things, so men allow those things, tradition, tradition, let him go and do it first. Eh? Party is any time. You can do party in 10 years coming. But let him go and pay. All those I don't know if they've done that though, because I've not watched any video that you say they've done it though. If they've not done that, call him. Tell him, okay, hobby. I agree with you that is when you want or this, fine. But let your people come to my people. Let them pay. Let them take list. Let them go and get everything. Let me know that I am now yours. Eh? I'm sure. Then, if you not like, eh, you not bomb picking, then let them come do the party. That is okay. You have appeased the gods. You have done what in Igbo society or tradition they call omenala. But if you never do that one, in come the shift and, hmm, this thing they get K-Lego. This thing they get k leg. It's not as if anything. Even... As Chantel, our sister, was even saying about, talking about the cancellation, her face is not bright. I know now who will be happy if they call you and tell you that we cancel it because of this. No woman will be happy. But my sister, you are a potato girl now. You have to be wise. I don't know. I'm just saying it all. You have to be sharp. If this man never go do anything for ground for your head, call him, honey. I have heard you. It's not yet late. Call your family, make him come take list, make them do the things where it's supposed to be. Make I know say, I'm sure because you know, now I am a hot cake. Make him know that you are a you know, I know you can't, I know what you can do. So don't just sit down there and say it's for next week, it's for this week. Now it's not early 2024, but it's even I can say ending of 2024. Hmm. This thing they get K leg for my eye. Oh. This thing is getting K leg, but I pray because I so much love you. Eh? I pray let this thing work well. But even her face is not bright as she's saying it. That means she's not happy. I have been watching all her back to back videos, content she has been doing, how she wants her perfect wedding to be, people she wants, what she will not like, what she will like. She has been making, she has a series, I think a playlist of her dream wedding 2024, two years from now. 
I know some people say, ah, what is the ah? Let her just bet, my sister, eh? If you are, if you just stumble across in my video, bet, eh? If the husband never pay your bride price, if he hasn't yet gone traditionally as he's supposed to do, I think he's an Igbo man. I don't know where he's from. Call him if he's not an Igbo man. Tell him that he might, because I know you're an Igbo, you're an Igbo lady. You to your son name, I know. So tell him oh, that see oh, you have to pay for my bride price first. Do all those things then. If you like, 20 years, 10 years, you can come. We do the big party. Party not the end. Every day is party. But the most important thing, secure it. Secure it, my sister. Oh, hmm. That through 2024, you are saying, for me, oh, I think it's a little bit late. But So, my queens and kings in the building, let me know down in the comment section what you think about all this. If you think like me, that Chantel should talk to the husband or the fiancé to come and pay for the bride price, take lease, do everything. That is the main culture. That is the main wedding in Igbo land. Then other things, party can come at any time. So now some of you think, oh, anyway, Sha, thank you so much. Subscribe and drop your comment. Bye.